What's up everybody? Uh, welcome to the next Fire Academy video. In this video we're going to go over uh, most of the stuff we've already done in the last videos and kind of put it all together into an active scenario. So uh, what we got going on is a mattress fire on the first floor of building 4. So let's go check it out. Alright, so we're uh, on scene at this mattress fire. We'll transmit a 1075 because it's pretty clear we've got a good amount of fire in there. Let's go ahead and uh, get, get these doors and windows open, get some of this smoke and fire out. These doors are already unlocked, so no need for forcible entry here. Uh, we got a roll down there that I'm going to go ahead and grab the K12 and get that open, and we'll get a lot of the fire out of there. Alright, so we got that uh, roll down open. Looks like we've definitely got extension up to the second floor. Um, so this is kind of getting out of hand. We don't even have a hand line in operation. Fire must have been going up through the walls. Alright, so uh, we're also getting reports of somebody trapped on the, uh, on the third floor. So what you heard is glass breaking and that happens automatically once the fire uh, hits the window for long enough. And once that happens the fire will uh, start venting out of the window. So what we're going to do is go ahead and get this uh, stick up to the third floor fire escape. See if we can reach that victim. Here. I won't be surprised if the uh, fire extends up to the uh, this top floor. Looks like we've already got smoke and fire coming out. So as the OB man, I'm going to go ahead and start venting. They said the uh, there's a victim right there in the uh, apartment. We're gonna try and have to. We're gonna try and get to him before the fire does. So we put pulled out some of the uh, the uh, wood panels off the windows. Looks like there's fire starting to uh, take over the victim's apartment. Very position to stick to the roof. And, uh, Alright, in this scenario, um, I don't think interior operations would be a an option. So, it's pretty obvious that our victim is probably dead. But if I had AI and uh, a team of firefighters, we could have uh, done everything. So, my main objective now is just going to be to put this fire out. And then we'll go for searches throughout and see if we find anybody. Alright, so one thing I want to show you guys, which is pretty cool, is uh, we've added the monitor to the front of the tower ladder. So you just press X to uh, enable it. We're going to start on the top floor where the victim is and uh, try and put that fire out. So I'm using the arrow keys. So what I'm going to do is just knock down the bulk of the fire with uh, 
with the tower ladder, and then I'll go in and try and knock down the, sh the rest of the remaining fire with hand lines. Visible fire, I can see I'm trying to knock that down right now. Alright, so I'm going to work on the first floor because uh, that's going to be our entrance to, to get up to the victim. I'm going to start knocking down some of the fire here. Alright, so it looks we got look we got the bulk of the fire knocked down there. Alright, what I'm gonna do is switch to the irons for 68. We're gonna head up and do a uh, we're gonna head up and do a search. Alright, we're gonna head up and do a search of the uh, top floor and see if we can find the victim. Now that we got the main body of fires knocked down on each floor. I'm gonna grab my halogen, we're gonna head up. Alright, there's our victim. We're gonna go we're gonna go for him, so we can grab him. So we're losing health because uh it's pretty hot in here, so let's try and make this quick. Well, is to at least get him out of the fire apartment. Alright, we got the fire victim out of the apartment. Uh, now we're going to switch over to 7-8's nozzle and knock down the rest of the fire. Uh, but first, we're just going to do a quick sweep of the rooftop, see if we have any extension into the roof and the top loft. Okay, so yeah, it looks like we do. We'll pull the line out. Okay, knock him down some of this fire. So as soon as I open this door, I'm just going to start spraying.
most of the fire knocked down uh, throughout the, the, uh, the floors. Uh, looks like we still got fire on the second floor and through the roof. So what we're going to do is bring our tower ladder bucket back and use that to uh, extinguish some of the fire on the roof. And then we'll go in and knock down the remaining fire on the second floor. Now, uh, once we implement multiplayer and AI, this whole process will be a lot uh, smoother and easier since you kind of have everybody doing their own jobs. But right now, it's it's fun uh, trying to manage this stuff by yourself. So it's kind of a challenge. So we'll go ahead and try to spray some water down onto the roof. Alright, so it looks like we uh, got the fire knocked down, so that's uh, kind of how the tower ladder operations work. So what we would do now is vent the rooftop uh, to get the rest of this steam out. We've uh, opened all the doors and windows, so after a few minutes the uh, rest of this steam and smoke should go away. Uh, just an update on how the update's going. Uh, as you can see, we're just kind of wrapping up a few things. Um, the sale for the game started on the 22nd, so you can get the game 35% off right now, which is a good idea because this update is coming this weekend. And uh, it's a good idea to go ahead and get the game if you don't have it while well, it's uh, cheap. And you can enjoy this stuff that just music comes out. So we're just got to finalize a few things with the air logic, the ventilation, uh, the firefighting, and things like that. So you'll have a few different scenarios pre-made in this fire academy that you'll be able to uh, manually select or enable to practice on. Um, as for the city map, there's nothing that we've done on that because we've been spending all the time working on on the uh, fire academy so uh, this is probably the last fire academy video until the update um, we kind of just wanted to give you an idea of uh, a certain amount of things that you can do when it comes to